How about some coffee, Johnny? No, thanks. It's like I picked the wrong week to quit smoking. I want the best available man on this. A man who knows that plane inside and out. It won't crack under pressure. How about Mr. Rogers? Mayday! Mayday! Mayday? What the hell is that? Mayday? Why, that's the Russian New Year. You know, we'll have a big parade and we'll serve hot or dirty. Well, I don't know what's going on. Chief, this weather bulletin just came off the wire. Johnny, what can you make out of this? This? Oh, I could make a cap, or a brooch, or a pterodactyl. Could you, um... Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit amphetamines. Johnny, how about some more coffee? No, thanks. Cause for alarm. Henshaw, take over. What, what, what kind of plane is it? Oh, it's a big, pretty white plane with red stripes and curtains in the window and wheels, and it looks like a big tile and all. OK, boys. Let's get some pictures. Pressure. He's off, Rex. He hasn't flown for years. It's not his fault. It could happen to any pilot. It happened to Barbara Stanwyck. You can't push him too hard. He might break. I don't remember who you're dealing with. Nick, Pete, Jared, there's a fire in the barn. Bad news. The fog is getting thicker. And Leon's getting larger. Look at this. Passengers certain to die. Airline negligent. There's a sale at Penny's. Me, John, big tree. The tower! The tower! Rapunzel! Rapunzel! Your husband and the others are alive, but unconscious. Just like Gerald Ford. Now, there's a chance that we can save them if Stryker can get that plane down in time. That isn't much of a chance, is it? I don't know, Lynn. I don't know. Well, we're doing everything we can. Now, excuse me, huh? Where did you get that dress? It's awful. And those shoes and that coat. Jeez. <laughs> All that water. Put down more flat. Just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, look behind me, Tom! Yeah.